Hello, my name is Tom Palmer um, and I'm a children's author and um, today I'm going to read um, from my very short book, Real Cricket. Um, and I wrote this because I like cricket a bit, not as much as football and rugby, but I like cricket a bit. Um, and there's not that much cricket fiction for children. Um, I go around a lot of schools in the south and in the north and there's just not enough cricket fiction. There is one Australian um, series called Glory Gardens, which is a really good cricket series, if you want to check that, that one out um, by an Australian author. Anyway, I'm going to try and read this to you over the next couple of minutes. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to try and show you the picture at the same time. So let's see if it works anyway. So I won't be in picture, which is probably good news. Real cricket. <laughs> Real Cricket by Tom Palmer, illustrated by Eva Sosheva. Out, Adnan shouted as he caught the ball. Adnan and his friends were playing cricket on the street, using wooden crates as wickets. As Adnan bowled, he dreamed he played for a real cricket club. When it started to rain, Adnan's friends went inside to play Xbox, but Adnan kept on practising, bowling at a wall. He loved cricket too much to let the rain stop him. When it got dark, too dark, Adnan went inside. He stared at the posters of cricketers on his bedroom wall and wished more than anything that he could be one himself. The next day, the sun was shining. Adnan's first ball beat his friend Tahir, smashing them to the crate. But as Adnan celebrated, he heard a shout. The broken crate had hit a car. A man wearing cricket whites climbed out. Adnan realised the man played for the local team, but his excitement disappeared when he saw the man's stern face. Who bowled that ball? he asked. I did. Adnan admitted. I need to talk to your parents, the man said. Adnan's heart sank. Adnan waited in the hall while the man, Mr Hussain, spoke to his parents. Adnan knew he'd be in big trouble. The door finally opened. Adnan's heart skipped a beat. But his dad, mum and Mr Hussain were all smiling. You're an excellent cricketer, Adnan, said Mr Hussain. I drive past this street every day and see you bowling. Would you like to try out for our youth team? Less than an hour later, Adnan stood on a real cricket pitch with his parents and Mr Hussain watching from the clubhouse. He took a deep breath, ran up and bowled his first ball. It hit the wicket. Adnan punched the air. He couldn't believe it. His dream was coming true. And this was just the beginning. And that is the end of the story. There's some other sort of material in the back of the book. And this was inspired, I used to live in a town called Todmorden, um, which is sort of near Burnley and Halifax. And um, I used to see a lot of young, young lads playing cricket on the street. And this was inspired by that. Um, anyway, I hope you enjoyed that. And... Um, I suppose there's not much cricket going on at the moment, but when the cricket season starts, um, I hope you all really enjoy it. Thank you for listening.